no, 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 no. You will never just put us in a show just like that. No, I don't care. Yes. No, no, no. First of all, we're going to start this because I'm feeling like Miles Morales right now. I faced all them. I faced all them. And I'm stronger than them. So, nigga, you will never make me wait six hours after I get off work to do a fucking show, nigga. So, so don't you ever rush me into a show ever again. <laughs> nigga, fuck out of here. Joe, this is a <laughs> animated cartoon series. <laughs> <laughs> Which I took a lot of inspiration from. I'm, I'm, not, play, I'm not playing hey. that stuff no more. But I'm it not stronger was... than Prowler. But but do, do you have the venom? You got the you got the venom touch. I the, might no. The... I don't have the venom touch yet. I'm hoping this happens to Miles Morales at some point though. But I guess we're gonna. Get I, I, into I, it. Well, that, that's what it's all electric. That's what the electric thing is called. But not to be confused with the venom symbiote. See that this is, um, hey. So for y'all that don't know, we're reviewing <laughs> Spider-Man. Look at Joe's uh, shirt. <laughs> we're, we're, we're reviewing um, uh, Spider-Man uh, across the multiverse today, um, in case y'all didn't Spider-verse. know. Across uh, across Spider-verse. Spider-verse. I, I, I'm sorry. There was a mention of Doctor Strange in there and a lot of yeah. different cameo and mentions in there, which made me love this movie so much. But uh, How'd you hey, feel yo, about how much they mentioned um, stuff being canon, Joe? I'm going to tell you, I, I, actually, I like that part. And I'm going to tell you what's canon. First of all, Zell May, what's up? Introduce yourself. That's he's canon. This show is always canon. Like, after Zell May looking cute, looking clean, looking sexy, you are on Overall 99 Media. And I'm joined with, of course, the one, the only, best in the Midwest, Unico Williams. How you doing, Unico? Nigga, I'm hosting. Why? Don't put it back on me. I just introduced you. Excuse no, me. You never know. said your name. <laughs> they don't know who you are. <laughs> I, the name's right there. Y'all know what it is. I'm the original <laughs> Spider-Man after Peter Parker. And below me, I got my boy Afro Kami 765. What's happening, my guy? You, you ain't gonna a... make me... You Hold on, hold on. No, go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> you already know. Your local neighborhood scumbag. Tra- traversing the Spider-Verse. Um, the, web, the web of fate and destiny to um, talk about um, anthropomorphic spider people. And, and and I'm not I'm not I'm not gonna rant unless Zelma provokes me to do so. So I'm gonna leave it alone. I'm hosting this shit tonight. This is my favorite hero, and he's helped shape who I am. And we watched we watched the movie that I just mentioned a second ago. Gentlemen, your initial thoughts on the movie. I'm not telling the story. We just talking about it. I'm not gonna make this a long ass show. Let's just talk about it. Um, they gonna make shit. And, <laughs> and guess what? And guess Tori what? Ain't even doing it. Tori ain't your fault. We're not starting anything. <laughs> I just want to say, ladies, it only takes the little things. These things make brand wagon. How much you pay for it? They gave it to me for watching it in IMAX like a real nigga. How much you? Pay this for nigga that? went and. <laughs> This nigga, look at here I, was, here I was, here I was, here I was bragging, here I was bragging about how my smart TV won the day. This nigga went back. <laughs> if you go, if you go pay IMAX for the things that you like, they give you special things, nigga. Did as soon as they let me smoke weed in IMAX, I will give them my money. How much you pay for that? How much you pay for your ticket? Just? I IMAX pay for my IMAX ticket. Twenty nine ninety nine. They even they, thirty they even thirty get, something after tax. They they even <laughs> they even gave me a rubber band, nigga. Oh snap! Is it a, is it a is it is it just a regular rubber band or is it like a cool Spider Man themed rubber band? It's it's it's, it's uh, a regular ass you, rubber band, huh? It's 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 like what 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 you black people would probably put your ones and twenties in if you had half, enough of them. Half black person. I it's, put, it's, that's, it's what I keep, two people would I keep half, money. I keep in. half my money in my wallet. Thank you very much. Anyway, Spider Man, Miles Morales. We start off. With Gwen, she's going through her thing, and, and at, at some point they showed a cool ass Da Vinci. Vulture. I like I that like how this dope. movie the the first segment was more it, it it almost made it feel like it was Gwen and Miles's movie, and it gave us that nice backdrop of Gwen that we didn't get in the 2018 into the Spider Verse. So, Do y'all see yeah. how my boy Tori gets more professional every now and then? He's he's citing the years that stuff is coming out. Like I'm here for it. I'm here for this. This is a transformation. Have you been bitten by the the professional bug? He's been yeah, on I, no I, jumper I, I, He's been on I, no I, jumper I, Good podcasting. See, good good podcast. 
<laughs> Wait, so you went, so did you get, did you subscribe to No Jumper so that you can see the behind the scenes, how they write shows? No, I'll never pay for anything on the internet. That's blasphemy. I'm still on Reddit, so you got the bad podcast. I was say, Reddit, Reddit, Reddit's for everyone. Good podcast and bad podcast and singing. It's, it's, that's also fair. I mean, man, but but that the Vichy scene showing uh, that Vulture, they what they they are in the love Vulture with was a Vulture slapper in this. Everything. It was I crazy. He, sh- he he should have been easily defeated, but like no, nah, he got more gadgets than the the one that we know, the yeah. the ones that we know, right? Way better than the dope. Vulture and, and Venom. And then we had uh, so so you know Gwen's doing her thing and something bad happens to yeah, her. Yeah, that Vulture movie. movie. So she joins the she joins the Spider League. And her daddy said, "Pull her, her daddy." This is important. Her daddy said, "Put your hands up, Dad. You gonna really arrest me?" I was leaving Call that out purposefully. Kids. That's why I said it the way I said it. I wasn't gonna spoil it. But it's imp- it's important to the the scene, it's the bravado of the movie. D- I did not tell you I was hosting this. Stop, stop, Zelme. You just hosted wrestling. You okay? Relax. We want your opinion now, all right? I got this. So now, next step in the parade, Gwen joins the Spider, the, the Spider-Man version of the Justice League, and they gotta fix stuff because in the first movie there was a collide that whole collider thing with Kingpin and people can stay in. Kingpin trying to get his family back from the they other should, yeah. he, lost, he lost his actual family, so he was on a mission. To get him. he was basically gonna steal a family from another dimension. <laughs> this this is this is not our Earth six one six. This is another whole thing. This so, part of the venom was from Earth forty two. But he is also we found that out. He is from Earth Earth forty two. Why? Because our main villain is the Spot, who is a hilarious villain that I cannot take seriously. But he meant that shit. I've never he, seen he, somebody he, laugh he, and giggle about the. I don't even know if he was the main villain. He was just there sometimes. I was gonna say he was. He was, he was he was a perfect supporting character. Right? They, they added a lot of there's a lot of depth to this whole. So your mic did there. something weird. I don't know what happened. My mic did something weird. No, toys. oh toys. Oh yeah, I was it's about like to add, like out. unplug and put it back in. Start drowning out. But yeah, I, I, but um, yeah, a hundred percent. I thought I so. Check, check, check. This is it. This dude is dangerous. Oh, go ahead. Yeah, we can hear you. Okay. Is it good? Yep. It sounds ahead. good. Yep. Okay. So, Spot, like, he comes out. He can't even push an ATM through a damn hole. He can't steal correctly. Like, terrible. But he's like, no, him, man. Him I'm trying to get into the ATM machine was comedy gold. Just him it was ended comedy. up punching the back. He could never get the spot in the correct place to try and get to the money. It was it was it was a really good little scene. And, and we got a scene where we, could, we actually got to see we actually got to see what it looks like inside ATM machine. I didn't know that's what it looked like. So that was you cool. ain't never watched the videos on YouTube where people go through and show you the earnings that they made on vending machines. It's a weird nope. little rabbit hole. I went through that down. <laughs> Niggas be making bank off of vending machines, bro. I got, I got, I got, I got a question, though. I, I got, got a question. that owns vending machines. Makes a decent money. I got Washers a question. And dryers. Issa Rae and Jessica Drew, isn't she supposed to be on MCU World? Yeah, bro. That's okay. We talked about this in the beginning. Was this, was this Sony trying to weasel their way into the MCU after they tried so hard? With Venom to distance himself, or is it Zelmay's theory that Disney was like, "Yo, y'all niggas gotta get in line with Spider-Man"? Which do you think it is, Unico? We is, didn't is see it, Tom Holland today. That's we, no, we no, we did it. not. <laughs> but we did. We got Doctor Strange references, though. We got we Jessica, get Jessica yeah, because I, I know because it's wild because I don't even know what you're talking about because we were talking about the spot, so I don't even know what you're talking about. Well, no, the the, the spot was the okay. Through, throughout the movie, there, there were a lot of scenes that felt uh, very pandering to the MCU. A lot of things that were translating to the MCU when Sony has been trying with all these other movies to distance themselves from the MCU. This one did not do that. Okay, okay. I'm trying to I'm trying to catch the vibe of this show because I didn't know if we're like just going to go on a linear path. I was or thinking, if we're just going well, just 
I was talk about like, it. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't know. Go through. No, Joe, you have Tor on the show. I gave up on it. I didn't even. We not. Trying no, to. I have you on the show. You the one that brought that up. We were talking about him. That's because I gave up. I told you I gave up. Tori on the show. You gotta just go. I didn't do nothing, folks. I'm just, I'm just here to talk <laughs> okay. about Spider Man. Okay, Spider Man. So, we're just, just going to talk about how, how like you can. not So we were talking about how, how the spot you couldn't take him seriously, like, but he's literally, like, a serious bad. <laughs> I, I figured out that I can go to any universe. I figured that out. I can do that. And I'm laughing and giggling and monologuing to myself, saying goofy ass shit that you cannot take seriously. But he said he got the power of the serious. universe in his hands. He doesn't. He doesn't. OK, I need more spots. And and, and then it, it starts getting heavy. Um. Yeah. So Gwen came back, blah, blah, blah. Stuff's going on with his mom and dad. They're doing they, He keeps lying to his parents. Spider Man 101. Lie to he everybody. Hosted about Jeopardy, you though. You got can't forget that. Man, host, ho, ho, yeah, that <laughs> yeah, that so which is got, interesting because Disney that might be a shot. Yeah, <laughs> moving to Florida. Maybe. maybe he did get in line. I <laughs> <laughs> got him in line. Um, that's what that's a great take, and it's insane too, which makes it even better. I love insane takes that have some foundation. That makes sense. And and so so whatever. Spot does stuff. And they end up at the ultimate council of Ricks or the council council of Spider-Man. And Spider-Man seeing all the random like Spider-Mans from all these different herbs, which are canon herbs. Uh-oh, I said canon. Yeah. And they're canon herbs. Everybody is canon from somewhere. And yeah, uh canon now because MCU <laughs> multiverse has been <laughs> We 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 just know that we are six one six, and apparently Spider Man should be here, but I don't know. But these are all these different multiverses, and then you got Miguel <laughs> from 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 tw- Spider Man twenty ninety nine. Shout out to Oscar he, Isaac, he killed that role again. Oscar Isaac is amazing. Oh, him as Miguel versus Moon Knight. So just do it all in King Guns. At this point. Anything can happen in Sony Entertainment at this point. Like I think that they ha- they hold these rights to, and they, I think they have a pretty decent enough um, relationship where they can make silly stuff like that happen and and gestures. But um, my one of my favorite scenes in there is and I will give this quick little spoiler: the Donald Glover cameo was amazing. I was I that caught me off guard. I busted out laughing in the movie theater. And Prowler was not happy. You gotta love Don- anytime we get Childish Gambino on the screen, bruh. You can't it, help it, but smile on your inside. Another hint toward the. It could MCU. be a hint. It actually could be a hint. Well, it no, was a, I think at the end, of, the last time we saw him in No Way Home, he w- he was caught by by Spider Man, and then in the deleted scene, he even called his nephew Miles. So, yeah. who's to say he didn't get into some jazz and ended up getting? Caught up in the web of That's, fate and destiny. Is that is that is that universe? So Tom Holland is uh six one six one infinity six one. Like is that what his like, is that what his is called? That's what they said in this movie, but they sell MCU six one six. Yeah, it's MCU six one six. Even though Miss Marvel disagrees <laughs> with it, shout out to her. She's upset with Kevin Feige over there. I'm so confused. Like, like who, where, what universe are we caring about? Because My, Miles is technically can, canon wise, comic canon wise, Miles is from Earth 1610, which is the Ultimate universe. 1610, Ultimate, Ultimate Spider Man is the one that is Miles Morales. Miles Morales is the original Ultimate Spider Man. Oh, Miles Morales is original Ultimate Spider Man. Yeah, the ul- the Peter. ultimate the ultimate run was a was a run. What would you say is I made from like two thousand eight to two thousand somewhere in the tens, somewhere yeah. right in that time. Um, they were really big on the edgy stuff. Uh, yeah, they tried. They tried to Wanda, wa- remember Wanda. Um, Wanda and Quicksilver had the incest angle in the ultimate. Yeah, they tried to be real edgy. They were really <laughs> edgy. But you got to think it was like Tosh point oh internet days. So and edgy. and and with some filler Naruto. But that, arts but, that going but that's on in where there. Miles Morales. Miles Morales is from Earth sixteen ten. Shout out to Disney XD. And, and so anyway, at some point they told Spider-Man his truth. You have to remain canon. And his canon thing is something that he could not take. And so 
He ran from the Spider-Verse and doggone it. He beat him. He made it back home. And Dr. Umar may, may be happy about this. Maybe he's not really feeling Gwen like this. Maybe he's feeling no, AI, like AI Spider no. Girl. No, no, that, first 40, man, that first 10 minutes, he's going to be real upset. That man drew, that man had like 200 pages of pictures of Gwen. Yeah, that's weird. <laughs> that's super saying, creepy and weird. He's simping hard. That we were weird. like, I miss you too. <laughs> but that's, but it's, a, it's a cartoon. That's Cartoon levels of simpery. If his <laughs> mom saw that, if his Puerto, Puerto Puerto Rican, she's Puerto Rican. Yes, she is. Puerto Puerto, if his Puerto Rican mom saw this, dad from Brooklyn, on second floor. Yep. <laughs> I love how they did it. That, if Puerto his Rican. mom found his his art his paint book, I think she would flip shit. No, I think she'd be like, Yo, she come, she come she come from money, mijo. She come from money. I, hey, I love how the person. He comes from a multiverse, and her dad's a captain of police too. She knows the money angle. She knows how much these niggas is making. <laughs> Yo, listen, I no, respect corrupt, corrupt the corrupt cop angle. Yo, uh, yeah, the principal, the, the, the principal, like we can save this. Y'all are illegal immigrants. See, like I'm from Puerto Rico. That's part of the United States. I was gonna say Puerto Rico. <laughs> Puerto Rico is a. Um, <laughs> It's part of the U.S. We just it's we, really the fifty-first state, but they I would say it's technically the fifty-first state. But we they can vote in the change. they can vote in the primaries, but they can't vote in the general so election. It's, it's just the U.S. territory. Yep, let's go geography, geography. Hey, turn up. And the only reason why it's not a state because fifty is a, like a round number that yeah, they like. We so they like yeah. <laughs> think about how, you, how think about how much you got to change up the flag to add one more star. <laughs> <laughs> so doing no, I Miles, doing that. Miles' dad, based off his last name, he is not just straight black, bro. Either. No, nah, but he looks he's like Dominican. He, he half Dominican, half black from Brooklyn. Oh, is he? Okay. And well, yes, the, yeah, yeah, but yo, you remember the argument? The mom was like, oh, Spider Man must be Puerto Rican. No, I think he's part Dominican. That's yeah. his dad say part Dominican. His mom, like, he's Puerto Rican. Okay, okay, I can, I can. I, so he, man, this nigga, he Miles, is half the island. Yo, this, this this movie island had so boy. many Easter eggs, it wasn't even funny. They killed it. So, 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 so yeah, man, uh, uh, Miguel, he with his with his angsty no, ass. The main villain of this movie, by the way, Scarlet. If we want, if we want to call him that, he's a hundred percent the villain of this. Movie. Yeah, he's not a villain. <laughs> Yeah, bro. He he's the, he is the antagonist of the You story. need bad things to happen to you like it happened to the rest of us, nigga. Nigga, that's how the Joker was made too. Oh, no, wait, wait. Started. Spot did the same thing that Miguel did. They I was to say, did the exact first. same thing. That, bro, that was the thing. That was the whole point. They were like, yo. Miguel did what Kingpin did. Exactly. And Miles did. Miles ruined the universe too. Miles didn't know what he was doing. Yeah, my, but, oh, but now he know what he was doing. No, everyone <laughs> else was in, intentionally doing this. Miles did it inadvertently. Miles wasn't doing it knowing. Yeah, the spots, all, the spots Spot, sent Kingpin the, and Miguel all did it knowingly. Yeah, Spot sent the he accidentally sent the universe and brought the spider to the this universe, which bit him, which yeah. makes him an anomaly. He didn't want. He didn't. He wasn't on purpose supposed to. Get and then that. that's why the spider sent because they obviously now, they coded it to go yeah. back to the spiders, the world that the spider came from, which obviously wasn't. And Kingpin was trying to get his family from another universe. Miguel he was trying to kidnap a family from another universe. <laughs> Well, Miguel said he died in this universe, so he's just going to go so, get that family. Yeah, and, so he got, this and he wanted to spend more time with his died. daughter, so he was just like, yo, I died in this universe. I'm going to go pop in here for so my daughter. He needs a father, and I need a daughter. I mean. What is Scarlet Witch glitch? Scarlet Witch ain't glitch. She's, she's a Nexus event. Yeah. <laughs> she's a once in a while. I mean, he did crump. He did destroy that universe. No, so. if she came in, it would have had to have been Ultimate Scarlet Witch, which means she would have had a it would have been her so, and Quicksilver. So Ooh, Molly Kitty it prime with them little aliens is coming. Was she yeah. Uh, with the, no, with the little dra- her baby that turns into a dragon. Yeah, don't turn the little aliens that take over their thing. What they call? No, she those had- are the vamps. Uh, so Bollywood Spider Man really did wasn't concerned about this whole his universe is about to oh, destroy. Things. Punk, we got we got Punk Spider Man, legit Punk Spider Man. I, I got him on Marvel Strike Force. Shout out to you. Man- Mandem. He got, we got Mandem. Hope my favorite. And they and even I'm... the the character the character look isn't super far off. He was the own the other black Spider Man when they because it was it was the nineties. They were trying it to was the nineties ca- and they were trying to capitalize on being Brit the the British craze that the Spice Girls ran in. I guess. Shout out to Hobie, bro. Hobie was anarchist. Everybody like, loved. Hey, 
I don't know about you guys, but I had a sex pistol phase. Punk is life at certain points in time in your life, depending on how you feel. I think the I think the most punk I got that like my level, I I, I stopped in Nirvana. See, I, I that I, was about as punk as I could get. Whatever yeah, wrestling song, I, fit, whatever promo I had was. I, I like. spent plenty of time in Moss <laughs> Pit, so. But hold on, I just want to I just want to throw back to Paravish uh, Parker. His his whole universe is about to be destroyed. They didn't let him speak another line. Yep. After they explained that that's what's happening to. So we just done with that? Are we yeah. just gonna let his universe crumble because the captain was saved? Because that canon level event didn't happen. The captain was supposed to die. The so. web of fate and destiny works in mysterious ways. Oh Madam my Web's god, will we get a Madam Web, Web in this in this somehow at some point? No, I, I don't know. We should, but it's a it's an argument because remember we had rumors that they were gonna try and do a Madam Web movie, which I don't think Madam Web, what Web amazing, yeah, yeah, but that's Madam Web, um, Madam an amazing Web. supporting Man. character, but I don't know if the character's strong Man, enough for a standalone yeah, film. Hobie, yeah. the best character, Hobie deserves his own film. <laughs> no, <laughs> I don't think he's like got. He's that deep. Like we, 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 we care about stuff an, about we that. Need anarchist Spider Man. He's he's a he's a comedy <laughs> relief relief. Tar, I think he could be in somebody else's movie. Hobie. But, 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 but I don't think you can make a whole movie with just him doing shit and taking shit serious. His comic was actually, I mean, it was it was fun. He he was a super they 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 nailed the tone of this movie perfectly. Like 100%. The, par, the parts where it was supposed to be funny, it was funny. The parts Sorry, where it was supposed to the parts where what didn't he say? It was a it was a but the parts that were supposed to be beautiful were beautiful. The parts that were supposed to be sad were sad. Uh, the pacing, there were a few times where I was like, is the pacing off? But immediately that was, they, they fixed it. Like it was, it was, I liked it. I wish I would have watched the, once again, I wish I would have watched the first one again before I watched this one. Cause I feel like it would have. So I'm going to watch it a second time, but I, I, off a of first watch and maybe it's just like the, the new time glow. I do believe that I like this one. I like the second one better than the first one. Yo, Hobbit, Hobbit told um the little baby. <laughs> he said, "Oh, pissing on the system, bro." When um, like your <laughs> when Miles realized when Miles realized they let him in on the baby wristband when he saw little <laughs> little um when when he saw Peter's baby. So when he saw he came in on the baby wristband, he was like, oh, all day. <laughs> we had some amazing kids. Hobie was amazing. But, uh, that's my favorite. Jessica Drew. Bro, um, which is, like I said. Up, and she showed up pregnant, just like in the in the run that was the lead up. They, they look, look. When it Why didn't they bring by Silk, Tor? Why didn't they invite Silk? I, I was wondering that. We did not get the silk specter. There would have been a whole lot of fucking going on. Let's just be honest. Oh my god. Speaking of which. <laughs> that's why they get... couldn't that's why that listen, they had all the other spider personalities, except for the spider personality is her, her whole gimmick is that whenever there's a spider person around, she's trying to she's trying to go to town. So of course you can't put her in the she it is a giant org, but she is she is she's a canon character. Silk so and six six one six, her character is literally there. They they gave the girl the same name. From and that, those are the powers he. Those are the powers that they gave her. Not that. The, the, that's them. They were the ones. It was that, like, an interesting she's, time. She's in the, the early spider sex spot. I mean, think they were trying to cash in on the spiders, and how do you make more? Of course, you, you got to get you, a, you know what? I think this is a good time uh, before we move into the the the, the, the last part of it. Um, some of the cameos we saw, like I love the Ben Riley cameo. Like, yes, that's exact. That was that was like super duper angsty Peter Parker arc. Like, man, that arc was weird. His yeah. suit was dope. Ben Riley, he was just arc. always I mean, he was the Batman aspect of Spider Man. Like, he was brooding all the time. But ben he Riley came, was he, he came in at a messed up time. He uh, did, man. Shout, I'll but, never shout, forget when he died, bro. He shout out to nuts. Andy Samberg. But um, he, he's actually came back since then, and now he's the ruler of Limbo. Well, he was the ruler of Limbo, and there was a thing with the clone of Jean Grey. But um, Ben Riley was played by Andy Samberg, which you can't go wrong with that. Andy's amazing. Even voice acting. I'm a super Brooklyn Nine-Nine fan, so it was a I'm good. sorry. The cameos were top tier. 
I'm sorry. So so Ben Riley has been in and he's been in stuff outside of the comic books? Yeah, no, no, no. He's just got his own comic series. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Which I, I mean, I, I, I knew that, but I'm just saying, man, that, that day. No, he no, I that. mean, after after he died, he, he came back, but he was missing part of his memory. It's a whole, um, it's like Shattered, shattered Web or something. I, I was very invested in that arc when he first came out. He's like, hey, Peter, I'm you. And he's like, oh, okay. And he was Spider-Man because uh, Peter had lost his powers. Yep. And then they went through that whole arc. And then at some point he fell on a car and turned to dust. And I was like, Ben, no, you had those cool web shooters. That was bracelets, man. That was so yeah. tight. But then, but like, but like how they how they depicted him in the in the movie, and he was like, Everything is wrong. Like, I was like, Yes, that's him, because he was not a funny Spider-Man. No, no, he was he was the embodiment of the angst of the of the Marvel universe at the time. They think they were trying, they had to sell everything. They're trying to rebuild from having to sell everything. They only got a few properties that are actually making money. He was the definitely one of the comic. best Spider-Man outfits ever. His outfit was amazing. The the hoodie, the, the cut off hoodie. You, you, oh, you, and, and let's let's talk about Scarlet. That's how you, Scarlet you like the you like the cut off hoodies, Joe. Joe, next time you know, I want to see you cut off cut off. No, he actually didn't have the. He didn't have no. That wasn't that. No, the original Ben Riley before the the, the cut gene, before before just, the before the cut off hood. Yeah. He had the web things, everything. But Scarlet oh, Spider glider, glider, yeah. Scarlet Spider came out uh, was in there. He had a very short run. They gave come. They gave like nineteen ninety four anime Spider Man. <laughs> so, they the bro, they threw some random Spider Man in here. <laughs> It was crazy. Uh, like, I got, I got him. They even put Pete R. Parker in there, the car Spider Man from the car universe. They had a Tyrannus. They had um the the horse, um the cowboy Spider Man. Yeah, the web slinger. What's, yeah, web slinger. Web had, slinger, um, bro. He said, the "What original. else? Can I, he said, What happened? What else can happen? A dinosaur just came out over with Spider Man suit on. <laughs> like, what the?" We did they, have Tyrannosaurus. They put the Venom Force in there too, because they have the Venom dinosaur to go with the Spider-Man dinosaur. By the my, by the way, Oscar Isaac was doing his thing, doing these little weird monologue. Yeah, he worked it. <laughs> I have to do what everybody else don't want to do. I am him. He is the least favorite Spider-Man of all time. He's so sad. <laughs> <laughs> like man, you are brooding. Like this is not the Spider Man we. Man, when you whooping ass or getting your ass beat, you're supposed to have some funny quips, okay? No matter what you joke about. It, think, right? think about all the hole puns we got. Think about all of them. With several hole puns going on in there. I think it's cool that Miles was just as funny as Peter Parker. I think that was cool. Um, but yeah, he escaped and he ended up in. And and so we found out that a spider came from another universe and actually bit Spider Man. So he wasn't even never supposed to be Spider Man. He's an anomaly in Peter Parker he universe died. Yeah. yeah, and he wasn't supposed to because he died saving Miles. And I I would feel like a piece of shit if I'm a reason Spider Man died. But I became Spider Man, so I'd be like, no, nah, real niggas probably was supposed to get it. The so one above all provides a plan always. That's that. <laughs> I think I, I, I wonder what that. I, I, I wonder what the what that Peter did that one above all didn't like him. Yeah, I was gonna say <laughs> he was he was a spider person. He was like, no, nah, you gotta get up out of here, cuz. <laughs> he was and a Gwen so, Stacy stand, an OG Gwen Stacy stand. Oh yeah, he didn't like that. Like, oh, you don't want to get rid of Gwen Stacy? You gotta get. So we, we so we had we had gotten to the point where 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 Doctor Umar would be proud because it seems like Spider Man Miles was taking a liking to the a, the avatar, um, the sister girl <laughs> that avatar. That sounds crazy. So the so so this might be the redemption person. arc. This might be the, they might. You know what? Sony might have heard Doctor Umar loud and clear. And go from there. No, but, they're, going, <laughs> they're going. They're going full milk and cookies with Beyond oh, Spider. Going full Spider Gwen. She Gwen came Smith. back, dog. At the end, <laughs> they, I was about to say, bro. They're about to have. A, there's going to be a whole mulatto spider crawling around by the end of Beyond the Spider Verse. Post cream, post scene credit. Oh, yeah, that, that, that was so annoying to me. It's gonna be only half white instead of like <laughs> it ain't gonna be half white, half black. It's gonna be half white, like twenty five percent. No, it's Spanish. gonna be yeah. I was gonna say it's half, half white, part Dominican, part Puerto Rican. 
know what I'm saying? That baby's going to have to go to the island. (laughs) That baby's going to have to spend time with Miles' mom. Because Miles' mom, you already know how the grandparents go in that community. It's over (laughs) with. You you hanging with them out. Lauren Velez killed his, 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 his mom. For real? Absolutely. So 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 was the character build as well. And so uh at any rate, um we 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 go to an alternate reality where and Miles figures out that he's not in his place. Did we already cover them capturing Miles and him getting to the device? Oh well we I just basically said that they that he that he beat all the spiders. He beat all the other spiders and he feels strong. He does does a monologue. His mom doesn't even know who Spider-Man is. Why? Because he goes to the to the place where his spider is from and it's and so there's no there's no spider-man there look at how and did y'all see all the chaos there's no spider-man if there's no spider-man new york is just absolutely a shit show and then you get cornrow miles morales as the yeah. prowler y'all and he had like a spider-man type suit which was yeah. you know it wasn't spider-man you know, it was, i was gonna say even though he ain't got no spider powers because his spider bit 616 miles or 1610 miles. Hey man, you know you love your dad. You love your dad, don't you? I love my dad. I'm trying to save my dad. It ain't my dad. <laughs> <laughs> and why would I do that? <laughs> and then it ended. And his uncle is still his uncle is a dick in every multiverse. I, man, dude, his uncle's a dick. Well, it, his his uncle's a dick because his good uncle Donald Glover got caught by the anomaly squad, all the other spiders, so. Look, the only good prowler. Now we got a bald headed prowler. Yeah, now we got bald prowler. Well, he's not prowler, but he's yeah, sidekick. he's a prowler sidekick. <laughs> Side this prowler. Man, this man was like, "Oh, what happened to your hair? It, uh, getting used to it, uh, man. This little nigga would never hug me. Something's not right, man. I hate the black community sometimes. Sometimes we just so fucked up, man." He was like, "No." He got to be Love from it. another universe if physical, you hug him. Like physical <laughs> affection from a family member? <laughs> definitely from a different universe. And he yeah, took definitely. his cornrows down, bro. Nah. No, he would so, never. He, he would never be caught lacking like that. First of all, so, he was looking. He was like, oh, no, this is not my mind. So he was like, yeah. <laughs> <This> <laughs> you took, you took your brains down. <laughs> that what mom said, dude. What happened to your brain? There's no bar. There's no barber shops that are just open. Did you see the chaos out there? You can't yeah, like, just man. go sit down at a barber shop. <laughs> Joe goes, just Joe goes to the universe. barber shop in a, in a spider universe. He's gonna be. He's gonna be the guy that ends up getting abducted by a goddamn super villain. That'd be Joe's luck. He's on his way to the barber shop. Just mind his business. Next thing you know, he's on the news. Some random villain got Joe held up. Spider Man trying to negotiate and kick shit out. Joe's like, "I'm such a fan, Pete." Uh, no, I, I'm no. Actually, actually, you're all, you're gonna hold it down. You're gonna hold it down out of the fandom. Joe's gonna be like, "Spider Man's gonna save me." No, no, I'm gonna, be, no, I'm gonna tell him what happened. I'm gonna tell him that. Listen, man, I got put in this multiverse, and I saw the the uh, I saw the version of my ex girlfriend that actually was shit. So I so I try to make things right. <laughs> try to try try get right, right with with mine, just in case she pans out to be a a, a banger like this one is. Facts. So what above all must hate Air Forty Two? He t- they know Peter. Yo, Parker. he's like he's like y'all don't get no Peter Parker. Y'all don't get no. Where are the defenders? Did, did they? Did they? They, they ain't even get the defenders, <laughs> bro. I don't know if we're going to... Uh, do you think we'll get other hero cameo, cameos in this? No, nah, they got too much to work with. It was MC, spider-wise, bro. Uh, MCU ain't finna be like, yo, you th- can yeah, we... Yeah, they ain't finna just be like, yeah, come on. Sony. We Sony did get a visit from Venomverse. We got a Venomverse and, cameo. And there is a piece of... A, we know for a fact from Homecoming, there's a there's a piece of a symbiote in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. What's that so, Miles doing? I don't That's know. That's an interesting thing to think about. Was that Miles doing... Or are we still going off of what Peter did? No, I think that's all. I think Peter's the word. I think that's how, ain't that how Kingpin basically. Well, I mean, they did ma- they did mention Doctor Strange in this movie though. Doctor Strange and that nerd from Earth six one six. Yeah, I like how they really like. Oh yeah, we don't f- with them though. Yeah, <laughs> they, they, they all. The- <laughs> if by the way, don't if, nerd, if, man. if y'all know why they don't mess with them, it's kind of that was the protected universe. Yeah, six one six one six is is home base. Yeah, Kang. I mean, the one. I mean, uh, he who remains kept that universe sacred. 
It's the sacred universe. So. And, and it was also it was also the universe that got the, the original um, Franklin Richards. <laughs> and no matter place. no matter what your uncle and your girlfriend has to die, some of y'all get lucky enough where your girlfriend doesn't die, but your uncle gone. That's yeah. that's it. Uncle Ben always has to go, no matter what. And if you get put in a position where you're Spider Man and you happen to be the chief of police, you got to yeah. Or Peter Parker can just go. Yeah, or you can lose Peter. You can lose a Peter Parker instead. You right? can lose a Peter Parker, which we found out. But it'll stop. Wow. He, he went the dot. He went the Doc Connors route, man. Really? Because you want to be special like you? Get out of here, man! That was so cliche. Hey, listen, sometimes Spider Man was, Spider -Man was written in the '60s, Joe. What do you expect? I would expect him to not say, "I want to be special," just like. Do we you. get Doc Ock, Spider Man? I mean, I'm pretty sure if you look hard enough in the background, there was there was one there. There was a lot of Doc Ock. You know, he should be the. He should there be the were, best there were a few Doc Ox in the prison. <laughs> he should yeah. be the. He should be the good one, though. He should be the best. He's yeah, the last one that needs to be in it. Like, Superior Spider-Man was bro. one of my favorite runs, yo. Superior <laughs> no, Spider-Man was fire. Superior oh, no. Spider-Man? Yeah, it was. They just took yeah. Doc, they took Doc Ock's brain and they put it in Peter Parker's body, so it was Doc Ock as Spider-Man, and he was just way better than Peter Parker. <laughs> what? What? So what? What? What Earth was that? Um, it was like Where four, Peter Parker two, died again. Apparently, no, no, he didn't even. He, this might have been 616 mainline. No, the superiors are 14. 14, to, I don't know. It's hard with Marvel. There's <laughs> a lot of universes. <laughs> that, I would say, we, at least, that's one thing I'll give DC. They finally got together. They were like, listen, we're, this is Earth 1. Earth here's one. Earth 2. And so on and so forth. But then they were like, let's get into it. We get into the negative hundreds over here. But we got Dark Knight's Metal after that. But either way... Um, that's why they also started over. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but yo, bro, we got too many universes. Um, Franklin Richards, Doctor Doom just in all of them. Yeah, we gotta just battle world it out. <laughs> which is his own, which is his own like sector. Battle yeah. world, like which I you know, I've been studying it a little bit, the multiverse thing, which I love that they're doing the multiverse thing. Everything's a multiverse, but it makes it get it leaves it open to tell different and unique stories, which is and cute. That, yep. But that, they was like, no, battle point. world is its own thing. <laughs> like well, they well, rather universe a crazy had, time and time it's a royal and rumble time. of multiverses. Well, yeah, they had to get rid of all of them. It was too many. Yeah, so they, say they had they had too many, so they had they had to wipe them out. So what they did was even though they destroyed them. They took the favorite parts that they liked from each one and mashed them into a fucking in the battle world and made them fight each other so they could get they made a thousand Thors because they love Thors. The, the, Turn the them Thor into and let's go. It was the Thor core. Yeah, Thor <laughs> and and Spider Man had multiple versions. There was only one. Cyclops. They were the police. They the were evil. the police of the multiverse. Well, how did we only get the evil Cyclops? We didn't get that. Because <laughs> it was just, <laughs> we didn't get a whole whole lot of mutants in the battle world. Listen, I don't know how many. Ones. I don't know how many arrogant Scott Summers you can deal with at once, man. Because at some point they all get above. He's the one that killed Professor X, and they gave us that one. <laughs> yeah, they were like, yeah. Was like a Superior Cyclops or Phoenix Force Cyclops? They were Phoenix Force. Yeah, Phoenix Force Cyclops. Yeah, regular Cyclops right. can't kill Professor. Yeah, X. Professor X will body regular <laughs> Cyclops. Leave that nigga drooling. <laughs> it's not that Cyclops has a hint. Doctor Doom body like, him though. Like, like the, the fact that the fact that it's canon that Cyclops does Mom have a hint of psychic powers is is like mind blowing to me. I'm like, if he's ar he's already a mega level, in a sense, is what they say. No, nah. he's like, he also has psychic powers. Him and Havoc both. My problem with my only problem with the whole thing is somehow Miles Morales Spider Man was surviving Doctor Doom when when Phoenix Four Cyclops would get body. <laughs> I'm like, how does he survive? It's Which doesn't even make sense. It's power scale, bro. <laughs> that doesn't make sense. Like, it's like Phoenix Force Cyclops should not should, should body everything. No, not not that Doctor Doom. No, not that Doctor Doom. Because he's he's universal threat. Am I correct? That yeah, Doctor Doom no, you got to think, por think he's a portion. He's got a portion of the Phoenix. He gets yeah. it all at the end, which and he's not a good. That's why it didn't work. You're not. Cyclops wasn't strong enough for the whole Phoenix Force. That's why they had to split it up among the X Men to begin with. That's fair. That's fair. And and that was Molecule Man. Phoenix Namor was fire though. 
Yo, they bodied up. Uh, Molecule Man, Doctor Doom, body everyone. Owen, Owen Reese don't play around, bro. Owen Reese's power set is crazy, which is Molecule Man. He ended the Beyonders, and the Beyonders storyline now is insane right now. But that's <laughs> that's that's my. We talk comics. With, this is I, 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 yeah, we we, have, we literally have a show for this, which is called Casual Conversations. I know we're giving y'all a little bit of a break, but we literally have a show for this, and we also have Marvel Mondays that we were doing as well. That might come back. Maybe we can revisit this conversation about Scott Summers and the 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 apex of his power. Yeah. But I would the, like the to have, that, this con- story like to have that conversation. But where Corn Rose Miles Morales. Yes. Or or it's none funny um Spider Man. Anytime. That's why it didn't funny. work when we were kids when they tried to make Spider Man twenty nine. I did the best I could to watch that show and I'm super big uh original ninety Spider Man. Fun Peter Parker with the whack ass outfit, man. He always had that co- collared polo, striped polo on. <laughs> anyway, um, that was that was my Spider Man. But then they came with uh, they came with Miguel, and I was like, this is so fucking stupid. The first what is Spider-Man he doing? I remember, the first they even did the paper sack Spider Man from back in the sixties when he got stuck in the Baxter Building. The movie, the movie is the movie is full of. Canon, so this is a very canon movie. Everything's canon now. Multiverse. And, and it's dope. We're going with the two parters. They went the fast X route. We're coming with two parters, sub stories. What's going on? It could be a trilogy. We don't know. It, Yo, it, fast it, it, quit. We, I'm the one of the we, we do know the, the 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 third one. It's called Beyond the Spider Verse. It's coming out in 2024. So that gives me that gives me cause for pause. There could be some cameos. What, what if we get a Scott Summers? I don't know. I don't know. Things that, they hey, are not giving them. X-Men they are not. They are not <laughs> listen, they went through too much to get the X Men away from Sony to let Sony put the X Men in anything. Sony lost all rights to touch the X Men after Dark Phoenix, bro. You know this. For Fox, but yeah, they... yeah, Fox. I think the best that they'll do is like play the and 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 a guy yeah. with a claw, a guy with claws. What do you mean? And then they'll just leave it. From, they'll just go from there. Just play the play the music. She Hulk. <laughs> she, she Hulk up for grabs, right? <laughs> she Hulk was a terrible show. It was a bad show. <laughs> Can we y'all niggas, y'all niggas watch all of that show? We did That's crazy. We did. Show. We Monte did. didn't. Even, Joe didn't even give it credit. Joe know I'm trying to defend show. He's like, nah, that was bad. <laughs> I watched the first three ever. episodes and could not. And I was like, no. My tail was so mad. Fourth, why would you go fourth wall for it for it for a season finale? There, there was it was it is not renewed for season but, two. But Meg the Stallion, you know that. Joe. Tore it, tore it. The show ended. I think they CGI'd her butt too. <laughs> so, no, I see I see that in them white shorts. I'm not going on that baseball field. I ain't gonna play. Tore the show ended. Oh my god. The show ended literally with them telling us. That oh, this was a mistake. None of this makes sense. Let's delete all of it. And then it just ended. And they were like, oh, we fin- me and this dude, we finessed it. Me and Daredevil. Finesse. But we got reverse mullet scar. <laughs> That's the end of this show. Spider Spider Man across the Spider Verse was a way better. It, it was, was better than the first one. The pacing, <laughs> Chef's kiss kiss to the pacing. Um cameos movie. if you're an Easter egg guy. Uh, off the off the walls, they they hit every little spot that they can legally. I mean, good good movie. Just whether you whether you think you're into animated movies or not, I'd give it a shot. Uh, I I I gotta say, ten out of ten out of ten movie for me. And um, it's not a Spider Man bias. I think it was just put together beautifully. And when and speaking of beautiful, the visuals were beautiful. There were so many scenes wow. that were so artsy. It was so beautiful. The Spider Man going trying to get, make it home scene with all of his villains, it's like to take chasing behind him. When they first thing. show you the web spread out, when they first get show it, and it looks like the little the little white tree of light thing, and then when the red cracks through, and you actually see like the anomalies and everything. Absolutely, and 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 the talk between Gwen and her dad that was beautifully painted. The colors were beautiful. Like, man, it was a beautiful movie. And I guess it was going off of the whole graffiti aspect that Miles was supposed to be so um, uh, set for. And uh, one last thing I want to say soundtrack. in regard to one one last thing I want to say in regards to Doc. Oh, the soundtrack was amazing. It was it was it was chill. 
No but, post um, Malone in sight, folks. Thank you. And we had Dr. We one last thing for Dr. Umar. Um damn, I fucking forgot. It was a good one. Damn. He had a doctor. He had an I bet we could have put a dashiki on him off of that. Hold on, there was like one last thing I wanted to say in regards to Miles Morales. I already spoke on the whole. He's probably gonna get with Avatar. Um meta metaverse spider, meta the, the meta spider. Uh Facebook spider woman. I can't remember her name. I'm glad that we didn't bring up pregnant spider girl too. So let's oh, see. Yeah, we just, we just called her Jessica <laughs> Drew, so you weren't the name didn't click for you, but she was actually pregnant in the lead up to the Spider Verse comics too. So she was I tried on. I tried I tried to like just no, they didn't that even mention her baby daddy, so maybe we're keeping that for beyond the spider verse. So I'm not gonna or maybe she's sport. coming to six one six in the universe she's from. Ooh. The only Jessica Drew is from six one six. I've never. I was gonna say the only. I was gonna say I don't. I don't think there are any other Jessica Drew. Hey, Luke Cage. What? No, that's. He <laughs> 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 just put a body black man there. <laughs> he was like, "The black man got me." Wait, it's not. No, you're thinking about freaking uh, what's her name? You're thinking of, I can never remember. I thought her name was Jessica Drew. Now that I think about it, the no, chick that it's, dates Luke Cage. No, you're so that you're is Jessica Jones. Jessica oh. Jones. That's oh, what it is. Which is also a black person's name, Jones. <laughs> I, mean, I can attest to it. And you can. I was gonna say you have first hand knowledge. I have first hand knowledge that you can't be black and your last name can be Jones. But that's who you're think, thinking about. But the woman my bad. was my, the ultimate. My bad, speech, Jessica but, Drew. Yeah, but Jessica Jessica Drew, she was pregnant in the lead up to the Spider to the Spider Verse comics too. So they really they did their homework. And like, if you're a hardcore Marvel, especially a Spider Man Marvel fan, there are Easter eggs for days in this movie. I'm gonna go back and watch it again. Um, I think. I think that watching it on the second time, I'll actually be able to focus in and sort of get in on, get to watch a couple of videos and like this and uh, see what other people have seen and that way I can look out for it. Are we ever going to find it? By the way, if she had that baby, that baby going to be OP. Like. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to Delta. Like said, maybe, maybe they hit on it. Maybe they hit on it and then Beyond the Spider Verse, yeah. Shout out to Daryl Drew. Maybe we'll see him one day. He's very rarely in the comics, but he'll be. <laughs> we we'll check him I out. But... I don't even know if they even said who her daddy was in the her fa- the baby father was in the comics. Did um, I'm, I believe they did. I know she died, and then the baby was little. I was just, uh, I I'm don't... spoiling the other future thing. Just just like, <laughs> Let's get out of here. <laughs> Take the baby off of Peter B. Parker, man. That Get that kid out of here. That was not comic relief. Get that kid out of here. So, yo, how, how do you think Miles felt when he was wearing the same baby bracelet? He, 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 he felt disrespected. He felt like a black man in America. You see the hat? No, I'll put that face back up there. I'm about to go in my mode. My Dr. Let's Lou go. Mode. <laughs> my, <laughs> we gotta get out. I ain't gotta get out of nowhere. We gotta, 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 gotta get out of nowhere. Hey, hey, listen, listen, motherfucker. I'm trying to fight for my rights. Hey, listen, man, you made me forget what I was about to talk about. What black thing was I about to miss? Oh, we don't know. <laughs> That's God. God. <laughs> God tell us to go. <laughs> All right, Tor, what can I find you? You already know. Afrocomi765 on all <laughs> platforms. Of course, here on Overall 99 Media. Being an Overall 99 scumbag. Um, just a fan wrestling Friday. You know the vibe. Something flagrant. Something inflammatory. Unico Jones, everybody. You know Unico. <laughs> Who are these niggas? <laughs>